I can't even believe that this pregnancy is coming to an end. This pregnancy has flown by so fast. But anyway, welcome to my birth vlog. I can't believe I've even seen those words. Welcome to my birth vlog. This is the second time I have vlogged a birth, which is just, it's crazy. But it is currently Wednesday the 16th of August and my waters broke during a membrane sweep this afternoon at quarter past three. So it is now just a waiting game for labour to begin. So I thought I would start the vlog now before the contractions do kick in and I'm going to try my best to show you as much as I physically and possibly can. Obviously, if you have seen my first birth vlog with Delilah, <laughs> that was an interesting vlog. It was very chaotic. It involved a five day induction. It was, it was a heavy long vlog. I will leave that link down below if you're interested in watching that because obviously the majority of labour experiences are completely different. I have no idea what to expect with this one but what I do know is I need to ring the hospital at 9am tomorrow, let them know about my waters breaking and that I was booked in for an induction but, but I just want to clarify the hospital are already aware that my waters have broke because when I had my membrane sweep that was when my waters broke so, my mid, so that midwife made the hospital aware on my behalf if that makes sense before the vlog goes ahead please just take this as a bit of a trigger warning i don't know what to expect so i don't really know what is going to be in this video so if you are easily offended or sensitive to the subject of birth then please stop watching because obviously I've re i don't really know what's going to happen so that's just a little trigger warning in advance anyway i'm going to stop waffling now i just need to put some last minute bits and bobs in my hospital bag i need to get myself a blanket my own pillow which obviously i'll bring because i'm about to go to bed it's nearly midnight um, and some slippers <laughs> oh i also need a phone charger as well but anyway i cannot believe that this pregnancy is coming to an end it's such a bittersweet feeling um it was an emotional one tonight putting delilah to bed the last evening of it just being me and her but i'm really excited for the future for me delilah and baby boy as a family of three obviously i'm a single mum to two under two which is going to be probably chaotic but my life is chaotic anyway <laughs> but i'm super super excited so i'm gonna get some rest now and i will probably see you i don't have a clue when it depends on my contractions start but i'll chat to you soon currently 11 27 on thursday the 17th of august i got to the hospital probably about half an hour ago i've done a urine sample i'm on the antenatal ward currently being monitored for the movements and then the dreaded word i'm having the pessary <laughs> again i'm here with my mom she's just eating a boiled egg <laughs> hopefully fingers crossed this labor goes a lot quicker then with Delilah. That egg stinks. Sorry. Oh. Anyway, I will chat to you soon. It's 5 to 12 and my lunch has just arrived. It actually looks really nice. And then I've got some soup in there. And baby's movements are being monitored as we speak. Also, my mum brought a baby name book because I'm still not set on the name. Don't say the name yet, by the way, of what it might be. But look, she's just been here. <laughs> with the book of names that she's had since I was born, which yeah. is 23 years ago. But anyway, I'm gonna eat my lunch now. Keep being monitored. Yeah. Go girl, go. <laughs> you got lots of energy there. Oh. Oh. <laughs> bouncing away trying to get him out I actually look like I'm sweating but I'm not it's what I've got on my skin 
My mum's trying to connect to the Wi-Fi, which is proving to be a bit of a... Oh, she's done it. My salad was really nice, so just going to bounce away for a little bit. And then I think in about probably now 20 minutes time, I think I'm having the pessary. But I'm just praying that I die late. I don't know. I don't know what the terms are. But I'm just going to bounce, bounce this baby out of me. I was thinking of the moon on the island. Mm -hmm. Seamus. Yeah. Doing this hurts your legs more than anything. Got jelly legs. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> Do you remember what the protest looked like last time? Is it like a flat tampon? Type yeah, thing? like a little string. Mm -hmm. So whenever you go to the toilet, make sure you just check, just to make sure it hasn't fallen <coughs> out. Okay. I'm going to pop your bed yeah. back a little bit. And then after we've done this, I'll just put it back on the monitor for half an hour. Okay. Are you alright like that? <laughs> oh my nervous giggle. So I'm just going to lift the bottom of your sheets off if that's alright. I love you. I don't like a funny shape, man. Huh? You barely like a funny shape. Oh, it's it's, not, it's not big, is it? It's not big at all. I'm intrigued. Yeah. Look. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I love the fact you've got your sunglasses on your head. <laughs> Bougie girl. Oh, and the God. window's place as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I always have a Summer vibes. Yeah. <laughs> right. So if you pop your legs up for me, ankles together and just relax your legs for me. Okay. Are you alright for me to go ahead? Yeah. <laughs> right, just some cold jelly. Okay. Right, well done. So you're still one centimetre. Mm. And it's got real loads of length to it still. Sorry. Just nice deep breaths. Sorry. Sorry. Hold on. Right, so I'm gonna pop it in oh. now. Sorry. I just had to come save it forward. Okay. So I'm gonna pop it in now. So it looks like this. Okay. Yeah? So make sure you just check when you go to the toilet. Or if you get changed, it hasn't fallen out. Are you ready for me to pop it in? Yeah. Right. Some loads of cold jelly. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Right. Done. That goes into the oh. cervix. No, oh, right. right. No. So it goes behind uh -huh. the cervix, or as far back as you can put it. Right. Um, obviously, last time <laughs> you did it, it a little bit too well. Um, yeah. oh, so this twelve hours does this be in? Mm. Yeah, twelve hours. Yeah. Just because your waters have broke, it's in a chance of infection. Then, okay. yeah. so we try and not do it for as long, and you can't have the gels anyway. Um, so. Let me know if you start to feel any tightenings. If you do start to have some tightenings um, and you're not having a break from them, let me know because I'm just putting it back on the monitor. Keep an eye on baby's movements as well. That feel alright, it's not too bad. It's alright. It's right? uncomfortable. Sorry, I'm holding the door. Oh dear. It's very temperamental. So, where have you put your straps? Oh, yeah, sorry. Thank you. So, pop your back on this for half an hour. Okay. And then, you're free to have a little walk around. Okay. Get bouncing on your ball again. Yes. Look, <laughs> <laughs> <Shut up. laughs> 
Your mum wants a gin and tonic. <laughs> That pessary softens the cervix. Yeah, yeah, so it just tries and gets contractions going. Mm. Um, it doesn't technically soften the cervix, it right. just tries and kick starts labour, then that's what right. that, tries that, yeah. to get the cervix right. to start labour. Yeah. I'm getting in pain. Sure, that's not a contraction. What else can it be? I don't know what it is. <laughs> Where is it? Is it? Is it? No, it's up there. Just there. That's perfect. Well, well, it's not. It's head. Is it? It's head. It's head is in your pelvis. I hope not. Ah! Don't oh, push it. Sarah. It might just be. Uh, I don't can know. you feel it? Oh. Stop putting pressure on. It hurts. I don't like it. Have you not felt this lane before? The fluid's coming out of me. Oh, good. Good. My <laughs> mum was just checking. Can you see it? No, I need you to stay. I need you to stay. Is that? Should I sit up? Because I'm just laying down. Right. You've got to do both together, remember? You're going to be a sandwich. So, me and my mum have just come for a bit of a wonder. What time did you say I had that pain? At 2.49. I don't know if it was a contraction or not, but I was in a lot of discomfort anyway. Um, all of a sudden, you could probably tell <laughs> my mood's just gone straight down. I feel like shit out of nowhere. I'm aching. I feel like I'm in pain. My head feels dead heavy. Um, but I think we're gonna go outside for some fresh air. I've literally just got I've got my belly out. <laughs> but I'm past the point of caring. Um, that's it. At the time being, I'm just so achy. I'm so 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 achy. And my head feels like, but, yeah. Behind the hospital, there's like a little Tesco Express. Um, so we just nipped there. I know you're not supposed to leave the grounds, but it's literally around the corner. Um, And I needed some more snacks and drinks. So we've just been there and I've just started crying. I don't know if it's the hormones from the pessary, but I, I feel like shit. I don't even know if I've heard, if I, can't even speak if I've already said, but I just feel like absolute Can shit. Use your card? Yeah, Sorry. I feel like shit, like emotionally, like everything. What? I just got, I don't know. I think it's because I know this labor is just not the same as when I had Delilah. Everything just rushing through my brain, like everything. I'm trying to sort out with obviously the baby and Delilah's dad when he's gonna meet her and stuff and it's just oh. There's nothing I can do. <laughs> it is what it is. Just the whole the whole I don't even know. The whole situation's just a mess. <laughs> I'm in so much discomfort as well. There's not much I can do <laughs> other than get him out of it. <laughs> but, oh. I was literally on cloud nine about an hour ago. And I've just crashed. <laughs> crashed and fall. But, we'll probably head back. I've just spat everywhere, sorry. We're going to head back to the hospital now. And I'm going to try and sleep. But I did try and sleep early, but I couldn't because of the pain I was in. But I need some paracetamol. It's time for the stylish sock. Have you worked much many birds, but... Yeah, I'm 
too fat to get my sock on. <laughs> Though the contractions have started, I've literally been bawling my eyes out, as you can tell. My mum's here with me. Um, we told my midwife that I was struggling with the pain, so I had some paracetamol and codeine. She came in to check on me to see if it's helped. I said no. So I'm on the monitor because the contractions have... What? I You'll know when I'm having one. I know, I know, I know. Um, I like to see my what contractions are becoming very regular. My mum was timing it like every two or three minutes or something. So, yeah. Yeah, there is one coming. One sec, guys. Too bad either, was that? No. Well done. Ah! They just booted you. What like a sharp pain there. He's on the move. Why is he going up me instead of down me? At least that'd be his legs, will it? If his foot just came out of my mouth. <laughs> Water in the neck is then anything. She had a pad on, there's nothing in there. Yeah, it's alright. Do the same again, Ruby, when you're ready, that contraction's gone. Bring your legs up far and just relax. What if you should have a contraction during the examination? Let me know and I'll stop. Okay. We don't really have much time to work with you without much of the going on. I've just had a big pain. Let me know when you're ready. You're ready? Yeah. Right. Just some cold jelly. Okay. Oh! Sorry. Right. Just nice deep breaths for me. Well done. Well done. Nice deep breaths. Do you want me to get you some gas? Yeah. Right, I'll stop. Let me ask someone to get me some gas. Right, nice deep breaths for me. Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, you let me know when you're ready. Give me a little nudge. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes on my face. I did this one time. I did this one are you ready? Right, just keep on relaxing for me. Nice deep breaths, alright. Just keep on breathing. Focus on that breathing for me. That's it. That's it. Right, I've got the process out. But am I alright just to examine you? Just to see if any changes happened. Is that alright? So, you're only on seven now. Go on, get it done. <laughs> get it done. Keep going again. <laughs> Let me know when you're ready. bottom onto the bed and I'll try and be as quick as I can. That's it, well done. Well done. I'm reading for me. Well done. Sorry, sorry. Do you want me to start? No, just keep on reading. Keep on reading. That's it, bring these legs up. Keep on breathing. Focus on that breathing for me. As far as I try and get you service. You're making me laugh. and just see what they say just because obviously you both have already gone and obviously I don't want to put this process back in with you having these contractions um, and just see what they say mm. is that right so I don't want to get in with you yeah so long, could you stay on the stretcher now as long as you need it yeah of course yeah mm. in there yeah I'm holding you again I'm sorry <laughs> Roller coaster that was <laughs> crying, <laughs> laughing. <laughs> oh, God. When I had it with Ruby, when I finished it and I turned to my husband and said, Have we just been to the pub and I wore a pink sequin jacket? He went, No. Oh, so oh. It, it's, what it made, it's what it made me do. Some people do hallucinate. Yeah, like yeah, not. well, I had. <laughs> This is my best friend or something. Oh, I can't remember, but it is my best friend. Yeah. <laughs> I've got um, stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I've just had an injection in my leg to help with the pain and how frequent my contractions are. Um, I've got this. <laughs> what is that? Fair black cover. Just sweetens it up. It's nice. 
Oh, she's not putting gin in it. <laughs> That's tonight. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, it's lovely. I bet you like it. Is it? It's a strawberry tea bag with a bit of black and cardial in it. <laughs> Original. Now I'm going to try and eat. My head's flying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, he's wriggling. I know, that's why I thought a contraction was coming. You've seen the light, you've seen the hole. <laughs> Spend your legs. I might put this in my suitcase bring it home with me. <laughs> Tell me when he's born. <laughs> Delilah. What you having? You having the Chinese? Oh. Uh, right, Lily, I'm going to go because I'm getting examined again. Right. Bye bye. Show Amy the size of Yeah, Lily, show. Oh, she's pulling cases. Lily, show Delilah properly. Oh, that's Lily. <laughs> Hello. She's massive. I'm shiny my floor already. <laughs> oh. Right, enjoy your Chinese. Uh, <laughs> right, love you. Bye. 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 Right, fingers crossed. Let's pray. Yeah. How many do you reckon? Four. I'm just hoping that it's come forward. Yeah. And yeah. it's shortened a little bit. Yeah. Okay, okay. yeah. yeah. I don't know why it's going so slow. <laughs> Get that gas at the ready. Yeah. Start breathing on that gas. Now that's it. Nice deep breaths. That's it. Nice deep breaths. Let me know when you're ready. Well done. Well done. You ready? Right, keep on breathing for me. That's it. Well done. Well done. Just keep your, your bottom on that bed for me. Here, give me a hand. Give me a hand. Well done. Oh, good girl. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Just relax, breathe for me. It's best you can out, it's really hard. Good girl, good girl, good girl. Oh, sorry. Good girl. Good girl, good girl, good girl. Oh, darling. So it's still the same. Oh, God. It's still really, really long and still really posterior. Um, let's see your face. Still one so two centimeters. Again. So it's about two centimeters, but it's it's what it is. So let me sit you up first because I'm folding you in half again. <laughs> so think of it like a funnel. Think of it it's like a funnel, and it goes like this, and then there's a tube. Mm -hmm. So it's open by two centimeters, but it's still got that tube there, and it's still got that length. It's gone really really soft now. That's what's changed. It's not as firm as it were. It's gone really soft now, but it's still so so posterior. So that's why I'm in so much pain because I'm bringing it forward. Right, okay. Um, I'll speak to the doctors and see what they say, and they might just say, bring it round and we'll start on like the drip or something. Okay. The thing is, you've got your contractions there, mm. it just needs a bit okay. more something. But the best thing is to try and get you comfortable. That's what we we'll need you to do. Mm. Get you comfortable. Mm. <laughs> Look at you. She says with a laugh. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I'll go and speak to him and just try and get a bit of a plan. Okay. Yeah. All right, thank you. <laughs> I'm going on holiday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. I wish I was. <laughs> So we've officially come to the birth suite. This is what he'll go in when he's born. This is the bed. I also have a pool in my room as well, which she's just told us. Um, I don't really know if they'll set it up or not. I don't know if I'll get in it even if I did. Mm. 
I don't really know. So, and then here's, what do you call these? Oh, I was going to call it an incubator, but is that no, what that is? Well, oh. Well, no, this is Got this a is ball. That's where they'll weigh him. Also, how cool do my socks look? <laughs> my slippers. And I've just popped on my nighty because she's asked me to like get changed into what I'm going to give birth in. And this is from PLT. It has mama embroidered here. And yeah, this is the setup for the foreseeable now, which is exciting. What? You crap me up. Hi. <laughs> There, having contractions and then you're yeah, I'm documenting my hello, hello. birth. Uh, right. Let you do that. Yeah. And then I'll have a look at your hands. Oh, it's fine. I'll give you my hands now. Gotta <laughs> 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 go. I, to, I don't even know when the last time was that I spoke to you, but I haven't long been on FaceTime to my dad and Lily. Um, what else has happened? I've been examined twice, as in to see how dilated I am. Um, just then, the doctor just checks to see how dilated I am and to see if there was any more water that needed breaking, but no. <laughs> so now I'm just waiting for the uh, and this this and this. So I don't know the person to do the epidural. And I'm about to put my gown on now, so that's going to be exciting. So, oh, my anti Catherine's on. I'll speak to you soon. It's funny seeing you so giddy. What do you mean? You don't drink. I don't even see you tipsy, do I? So it's funny seeing you like this. I'm going to put some of the, uh, start putting some of the medicine down and then we'll dress it properly. Okay. So, <laughs> it's 33 minutes past midnight. I'm just here, just chilling. I had my epidural done. What the hell is that? I don't know, I've got all sorts stuck to me. On this arm, this arm, and my blood pressure's taking itself. They brought in like a pull out bed for my mum. She's having a nap over there. I'm gonna try and get some sleep as well before I have to start pushing the baby out of my vagina. <laughs> Show you my mum. Nice and cozy. It's now 3:15 a.m. Oh god. <sighs> That's what I was waiting for. It's now quarter past three. Um, in the morning, me and my mum have slept for about three hours. I keep pumping, it's so bad. But I said to my mum, I remember this last time with Delilah, because you can't feel anything, you don't know what your body's doing. Um, but behind me here, it's not gonna, oh yeah, look. See, you can see I'm having a contraction right now. But I'm just here loving life. <laughs> I've got my epidural in. I've got my drip in. I think I've shown you this earlier. I've got two things in. Um. Oh no, that's not the epidural in my hand, is it? That's in my back. Yeah, this one of this is like salt and water, basically. I think. Mm. I don't know, but 
gosh. Very bubbly for this time of the morning. I've not seen this time of the morning in ages. But anyway, bye. Yeah, there you go. Oh, it's very, um, so every time this goes green, whenever I press it, I get more of the epidural. My mum's got a tea. I'm about to have a catheter fitted. Should I not be able to feel this now? You shouldn't really. No, you might feel the, a bit of pressure, yeah, yeah, yeah. but you shouldn't, you shouldn't be uncomfortable. But you've got your gas in there, haven't you? Yeah. Just in case. Currently quarter past six a.m. Um, baby's heart rate is quite low. It's below what a hundred. And, yeah, she said it needs to be a baseline of a hundred and ten, and it's not. Um, she's gone to speak to the doctors. I don't know. I'm so itchy from the epidural as well. I think I'm gonna have a section. So it's currently, oh, I thought he was laughing at me then. <laughs> It's currently quarter to seven in the morning. I don't really know what the last time was that we spoke to you. Um, but basically the midwife has gone to speak to somebody because baby boy's heart rate. I'm not losing my voice because of this gas and air. Um, because his heart rate keeps dropping below 110. So she's mentioned a couple of times about a potential C-section. Um, but I don't really know. Obviously, I personally, I want to try and go for a vaginal birth, but just gotta see. Delilah, <gasps> morning. Did she sleep in that outfit, or is that? Okay. Lily, You're a better mum than me. <laughs> Where you been sleeping? So I'm 10 centimetres dilated and it is time to push very, very soon. But me, Zara, the midwife and my mum have done, um, what do you call it? We've guessed, the, guessed the weight of what he's going to be. My mum says what? 8-1. Eight, 8-1. One. Eight, one, I say 7-6 and Zara said, what was it? 7-3. Seven, seven, yeah, 7-3. Seven, Delilah was born 7-4. So I'm very interested to see what he will come out as because obviously he's growing to be too big. So that's going to be interesting. But I don't know. I'm going to be pushing soon. So I'm sorry whatever you do see in advance. You might see something. You might see everything. You might not see anything. You might see nothing. I don't know. Oh, this gas and air is making me a bit flowy. <laughs> Bye. Mm-hmm. How chillaxed does she look? I've actually been quite chilled all you have? the summer. It's 5.30. I'm 10 centimetres. All hell is going to be let loose. Yeah. I'm going to show you as much as I possibly can. Um, but obviously... That's respect. I've got to respect the midwives and yeah. the doctors. My mum's going to get as much as she possibly can. Yeah. But I'm so tired. I can't wait to sleep. And have some food because I've not ate since last night at 8 pm. <laughs> so, yeah, it's nearly time. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Snatch your breath, go again. A really big push into your bottom. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going. <laughs> That's right, just take a nice deep breath. I think that contraction's easy enough now. Oh That's yeah, come on darling, I can see his head. As long as you Ooh. can. Keep going my love, keep amazing. going my love. That's Ooh. all well done, you're doing amazing. That's come it. Come on, That's oh it. my lord. That's, That's it. Oh Ruben. Oh he's got hair.
That's it. Eek's got hair. <laughs> oh, oh come on. That's it. That's come on, it. Baba. <laughs> oh, well done, darling. <laughs> Right. Oh my, I'm so okay. proud of you. Go so fun. proud of you. Go on, another push. You're so doing amazing. Fair. You're doing so amazing. You feel so much of his oh, hair. He's got lots of hair. Mm -hmm. Quite dark. Mm -hmm. So we're going to tell you step by step, Ruby, what to do. All yeah. Right, love, so listen to us because we want to try and. Stop you needing any stitches, alright. Good girl. Oh, come you can Go do on. It. You oh can yeah, do he's coming, it. he's coming, he's coming. <laughs> good girl, good girl, darling. Good girl. Oh wow. Oh, oh good girl. Oh, good girl. Oh, he's out. Oh, he's out. Oh, oh, he's out. oh, oh look. Oh, oh darling. Oh. Oh, oh, Ruby. Hey, isn't that worth it? Hey? Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, because he's crying about it. Oh. Hey? Oh. He's ready. Oh. He's ready. Oh. He's ready. Yay! There we are. Oh. He was coming. Oh. I knew he was coming. Oh. <laughs> Gorgeous boy, so well done, Ruby. Well oh, done. Baby. To mummy. Let's get a nice dry towel. Thank you. Oh. Should I just come to the top of my little thing? Yeah. All the way skin to skin. Yeah. Oh. Oh, perfect. Oh, congratulations, oh. darling. Congratulations. Game, yeah. <laughs> Congratulations! Oh, you've done amazing. A little bit chunky, so you might have to do it once or twice. Okay, right, we go in. Yeah, and again. Here we go, little man. Whoa! There we go. Oh, well done, Nana. Yeah. Oh. Nana did amazing. Oh, he's out. He's out. Oh right. no! Sorry, don't be silly. Oh. Oh, yummy, mummy. <laughs> I've literally been looking forward to this since before I came to the hospital. So, guys, I am officially a mum of two. Look at him. He is literally perfect. <gasps> Let me try to show you properly. Heavy coat. I'm sweating by the way, I'm so hot. Um, but basically, now I've got to stay in the hospital for 12 hours to be monitored. No, um, baby boy needs to be monitored because obviously my water's broke and it took however long for me to give birth, so he just needs to be monitored to make sure he's okay, he's healthy. But I'm so swollen. <laughs> the epidural did this to me with Delilah. My mum's gone downstairs because his daddy has come to see us. So, yes, they should be walking through the door any minute now. I've had to shove my hair up because I am dripping. I'm so hot, but I can't have the window open because the baby boy, like, he needs to be nice and warm. But anyway, he's here now, so I'll chat to you. I'll chat to you soon. So, got McDonald's because <laughs> I'm absolutely starving. We've got everything. And then, this is little Frankie. He looks like an old man. He's so cute. Oh wait. Look, he looks like a little old man. By the way, I don't know why my camera's making him that colour. He definitely isn't like that in person. By the way, I think the midwife gave me something in my hand to help my sickness and I think I've reacted to it. Because all my face has gone really swollen and my eyelids. But anyway, I'm going to eat my McDonald's. That is my second birth vlog complete so i hope you all enjoyed <laughs> i know there's been some funny parts to it some sad parts to it everything but thank you all so much for watching i really really appreciate all of your love and support and thank you so much for all of your lovely kind messages comments everything 
all of them don't go unnoticed in the slightest. So, oh my god, my hand's swollen as well. Anyway, <laughs> right, bye.